So the third most important thing that uh, which signifies blockchain technology over else is that the blockchain technology uses uh, secure transactions. Now what is security? What do you mean by security? I don't know what is security. Okay, we have seen security, what does it mean? But while I'm talking about secure transaction, I'm talking about secure automatic transactions. Automatic transaction means, okay, uh, I have my credit card. In that credit card as well, automatically uh, I have uh, auto debit option enabled where on the day of my payment, my card, uh, whatever the outstanding amount for my credit card is debited from my account. Are you talking about that automatic transactions? Somewhat, but more than that as well. So more than that means that Let's suppose uh, I have listed my book on Amazon and in that Amazon platform where it is listed correctly that uh, if somebody purchases the book, then uh, the, the buyer of that book will get uh, the book what is promised in, in the shape that is promised, in the time that is promised and an option to return in seven days or so, which is also promised. Now the buyer gets it and he pays, he or she pays the amount as soon as he gets it. As a seller, I will get the amount, let's say in 10 to 15 days point of time after the person is okay that there is no refund uh, he or she is claiming. Now in every time that place in the Amazon marketplace as well, there is a system which is given that okay after every 15 days uh, or, or 20th of the month, you will get uh, what, how many books have been sold and uh, dedicated here. It's also an automatic transaction, but the blockchain technology goes even on deeper sense that whatever the entire Amazon ecosystem is, if that happens, then that happens. If the person is not having the book in the correct shape, then he returns, he is allowed to return. If I am not getting it, what to do? So if you see that entire trust we are putting on the Amazon ecosystem is because that Amazon is behaving in all the if, else, if, else, that way, what to do in that particular scenario correctly. This all thing can be done in automated fashion as well. As soon as somebody uh, orders the book, it is dispatched, somebody pays to it, uh, we will get the money after that much amount of time. If there is any dispute, that can be handled in that particular way. So most of the other companies are also getting automated, but inherently we are trusting Amazon. But in this blockchain technology, we will be trusting the code that is written. And the code will always behave in the way which is known to us. So in the blockchain technology, automatic transactions will happen automatically. If suppose I submit my first chapter to my publisher, the, the money will be credited to my account, which will be given in the initial uh, contract itself. That after first chapter, this is this much amount is released. There is no other person sitting in the publisher's uh, editor office that they will discharge, dispatch the money if that is submitted. It's automatic uh, transactions are there. In the US, there is a saying that the God we trust. People generally say that in the organizations we trust. In the blockchain side, we say that the code we trust. Thank you. See you in the next video.